Welcome to Spotlight on Frazee. I'm your host, Hank Ledke, and I'm here at Frazee High School with Community Ed Director Kivy Kivilak. Kivy Lax. Yeah, He's been drinking go. this morning. Yes, yeah. I had, oh, I, I had two cups of Marion Strong coffee. Yes, that will do it every time. So, we've got the fall lineup. Boy, it's looking great. So. Thank you. The catalogs just came out last week. Um, we do two a year, and this one runs through April with a new one coming out in April. We have a ton of classes. Well, I see we've got some interesting stuff, you know, especially that uh, goes along my area, you know, which is defensive driving. <laughs> I thought you were going to say cooking. Well, that too. Okay. Yep, defensive driving is always popular because individuals 55 and older get a 10% discount on their insurance, and everybody is safe in the community. That's right. We, we, we obey speed limits. We don't take up the fast lane. We don't hit people in uh, uh, crosswalks. There you go. Perfect. You've taken the class. Yes. A time or two, maybe. Yes. Okay. We also have a ton of painting classes. We have um, Katie Sandberg, Molly Riefenberger, Callie Nundell, and Erin Lill, all area artists that come and teach a class. And we have samples of all the paintings and drawings online at the district website at www dot phrasey dot k12 dot mn dot us and those look like some interesting classes i see the first one on oil painting is starting on my birthday october 6th well there you go fun project for you to do not on my birthday okay <laughs> i don't well we have some at the hostel hornet and vfw you can also drink and paint at the same time well that sounds interesting it is so check that out or call if you want to see any of those samples we also at the uh salvador dolly work <laughs> Moving on to cooking classes, <laughs> um, we have a number of instructors um, that are doing homemade down-to-earth cooking like homemade jellies. Um, we have a pineapple zucchini jam class that is absolutely to die for. The combination is great. We have artesian bread. We have puff pastries. Mm. <laughs> you might just need to come and taste. Yes, I think that's great. Homemade cinnamon and caramel rolls. We have a homemade cooking class. And then our second annual bake and take holiday goodies where people come in. They divide up all the recipes and everybody leaves with 10, 12 dozen cookies of different holiday favorites. And they will have that ready, put them in their freezer and serve them at Christmas. That's a great class, you know, because you go in, everybody comes in, and everybody cooks, and you all do different things. Yep, the cleanup's easy. It's right at the school. We have an excellent lab for cooking, bright windows. It's a great place. Mm -hmm. And then I see you got general interest in raising chickens. Surprisingly, it's been very popular. They um, Raising chickens in Minnesota in the winters is um, Brian Christensen's been doing it for three or four years, and so he's going to share his um, tidbits and passion and just educate the people that are interested in that. I, I think that's a great project. Thank you. We also have a beekeeping for the backyard and also a maple surfing for people that may be interested in pursuing those hobbies. It's just a general um, beginning class where they can ask questions and see hands on what is involved in that. Well and with the beekeeping it's very critical nowadays that we do help with our our bee population and it's understanding what are, who, what's bees what's wasp and what's hornets also yeah and yellow jackets go yes amen go hornets so and uh but uh we're going to take a break here and we'll be right back with kitty to continue talking about the community ed program this fall and winter Welcome back to Spotlight on Frazee. I'm your host, Hank Ludke, and I'm here with Kitty from the Community Ed, and we're talking about the fall and winter schedule for community education. Hi, Kitty. Hello, Hank. How are you? I'm tremendous. I want to talk about an upcoming class. Um, it's the history of Vietnam, and this one is a three-time class where we, on the third class, will invite veterans in from Vietnam to talk about their hands-on experiences, their overall opinion on the war and thoughts and it should be very interesting well and that should be an excellent uh class also i mean i look at uh i have a lot of friends of mine that are vietnam vets a lot of them have had lots of medical issues over the years and it's taken them years to be even be able to talk about some of this oh yeah and some of them still can't my dad's a vietnam vet and up until 10 years ago he we we just never talked about it 
And, you know, healing is part of the talking and people want to know their firsthand experiences. And this is a great way for them to share that. And that's great. We also have coming up a number of computer classes. Um, we have Denise Lingus who teaches the Microsoft Word classes and we offer daytime ones for businesses that want to send their employees or we do custom classes. Um, we have Paul Harstick from Minneapolis that comes up and he specializes in classes for the small business owner on credit cards from your smartphone, how to market your business on a dime, how to just simple classes like that that can help a small business, especially in our area, survive. Well, and I think, you know, the idea that you can use your smartphone now, you know, to access like with the cube and things like that, credit cards is tremendous because a lot of people don't carry cash anymore. They carry a debit card. Yeah, because most places don't take cash anymore. No. Or checks. Or checks. checks. Yeah. They'll take cash anytime. Yeah. But, you know, a lot of people don't carry cash on them. So this is a great way for a small business. And the expenses are minor, and it's, you have to move forward with the population, I think. Yes, you do. Yes. We have Brian Christensen at M State that teaches classes. Um, Bobby Heimreich from Detroit Lakes, anything from introduction to the computer to Facebook to more advanced technical classes. We have Brandy Chorgensen outside of um, Frazee here that teaches um, smartphones and iPads, and she also um, works at Arvig, so there's a lot of things. Most importantly, I need to talk about welding classes that we're going to be having. Um, Alex Adams. Um, and Mr. Hammer are doing an advanced class. Adam went to school for welding and teaches in, or works in Detroit Lake, so he's very skilled. Him and Mr. Hammers are doing an advanced class with Tretcham Mitchell starting in the fall with a beginner course for individuals that want those skills either for a hobby or their job. So those are popular classes. We have an open shop if people want to come in and use our equipment to build something, um, car care, just ways to save money yourself by doing those simple things. Well, and nowadays, you know, uh, dealing with a wire feed welder, you can just pick up a small uh, uh, wire feed for uh, around $100 nowadays yeah. compared to the welders we used to use in the old days, the old stick welders, the brazing and stuff. A lot different. A lot different and good way to get hands on and educated the proper way and way to do it. Um, we always have essential oils with... Um, Aunt Jerry Ann Burton, Becky Alschmidt, and Bonnie Juma. Um, we have Kelsey Hoff, who has B Salon. She is going to be doing a skincare class, and I took that. Um, it's fantastic. I learned that I'm the mature skin. <laughs> I didn't think it was funny, but once you hit 40, you're mature. So I, I, it sounds better than old, doesn't it? Yes, it does. So now how do they contact you about these classes? They can call us at 334-3181. Extension 3 will ring into our office or online at www.frazee.k12.mn.us. And definitely like us on Facebook. We update all the time, remind you of classes coming up, also samples of classes, any schedule changes, anything like that. So be looking for Community Ed. It's came in your mail. This is a book. Yes, and so all your information is in there, too. So, you know, think about what you're doing. Look at what you want to do and what fun things you want to learn or try to remember that you used to know. All right. Thank you. And then we have samples of our quilting classes. We'd love for you to come and stop in and visit, too. So thank you. All right. And with that, remember, pet the dog, hug the kids, kiss the wife, and wave at the neighbors. And we'll catch you next week on Spotlight on Frazee.